trained in geometry enter here for our theme is geometry and sitting around our comic section tonight we have the shapely johnny vegas Geometrical buzzers and Rob goes. And Johnny goes. David goes. And Alan goes. The wheels on the bus. Casual enough. Yeah. So the lady should approach you, you know, she's going, there's room for change. <laughs> but not too much. Uh, that's Two the... buttons down, part slag, part halo. <laughs> hey, anyone have any thoughts as to why he might be looking, or might not be looking swell? Is it to do with the direction of his stripes? It is to do with the direction of his stripes, Rob Brydon. It is. Look at the picture of an earth. It's extenuating my breasts. <laughs> <laughs> on the left, that's, that's Alexander Armstrong on the left. It does look a bit it does, doesn't it? Yeah. It does yeah. look like it. Yes. It's, it's, what, so it's what they do with fat people. They make them wear stripes and you can tell how old they are. It's like cutting a tree in half. <laughs> But it's supposed to be that vertical strikes make you a bit slimmer, but they don't. You're right. That's the point. You're absolutely people, right. People who they should wear the, uh, the horizontal yeah. ones. Yeah, the hoop. Johnny is sporty. It's very interesting and surprising because almost everybody thinks that vertical strikes make people look slimmer. In fact, in prisons, sometimes women have asked for vertical rather than horizontal stripes so that they look leaner, or they think they look leaner. But it turns out, research from a man called Dr. Peter Thompson of York University has discovered that the large majority think the one in the vertical stripe is larger than the one in the horizontal stripe, and they are the same size. Surely this shows, actually, that, that it makes no real difference at all. Because what, what this, we're determining whether wearing vertical or horizontal stripes makes you look thinner. Yeah. And you can't tell by looking. You have to do research. It's <laughs> yes. so slight. Yes. You have to do research with hundreds and hundreds of people. Basically, people look as fat or thin as they are. I beg to differ. <laughs> friend was quite short, and uh, he likes to wear vertical stripes because they make him look uh, taller. Only when he's not standing next to anyone. <laughs> it's not going to make him look taller than a taller man. <laughs> it's all relative. It's just, you'll just say, well, there's a normal-sized man next to an enormous man. <laughs> oh, thank God, he's taking his striped shirt off. It's actually a tiny man next to a normal man. I missed, I missed your angry logic, David. <laughs> I think it just alternates, doesn't it? Because for ages you think, okay, vertical stripes make people look thinner. Then you say, oh, she's wearing vertical stripes, therefore she must be fatter than she looks. Therefore you start thinking, oh, she looks fatter because she's wearing vertical stripes. So suddenly horizontal stripes start making you look thinner. Because, oh, she must be thin, otherwise she'd never dare wear horizontal stripes. Then you go, oh, no, horizontal stripes make you look thinner. Oh, she must be fat. She's wearing horizontal stripes. <laughs> Someone walking up with polka dots and you're going, she must.
Truth. 